Did you know that despite having no form of writing, the Inca Empire used complex instruments to perform mathematical operations? Welcome to Maths from the Past. The Incas used yapanas to perform addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. These had five columns and four rows. The columns represented thousands, hundreds, tenths, and single digits. And the rows followed the first four numbers of the Fibonacci sequence to represent the exact quantities of thousands, hundreds, etc. The first row with one hole is not used to count, but to remember to carry one unit. To solve the addition 328 plus 253, first we place the number 328 on the yupana. Next, we put the number 253 on top. To add them, we place the black dots on top to their corresponding column. Starting on the column furthest right, we place black dots on the holes, but because it becomes full after the second, we carry one to the next column. We then remove the dots from this column, leaving only the one we still had not counted. We now have six dots to place on the second column. This way, we can end up with eight dots in this column. Finally, we place the two dots in the 10 squared column to get five in total. Now we count the new values to get 581.